Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to dive deep into a fascinating topic that brings together two big games, Helldivers 2 and Destiny 2. Specifically, we'll be exploring how Helldivers 2 can learn from one of Destiny 2's most controversial features. This is a must-watch for anyone interested in game design, community feedback, and how developers can avoid repeating past mistakes. So what's the controversy we're talking about? It's Destiny 2's introduction of the Eververse Store, a feature that sparked major backlash due to its focus on microtransactions. Players were concerned that the game was shifting towards a pay-to-win model with monetization taking precedence over rewarding actual gameplay. This feature left a sour taste in the mouths of many fans and led to significant changes in how Bungie approached in-game purchases. Now let's connect this to Helldivers 2. As this game evolves, there is a real opportunity for the developers to take a different approach by learning from Destiny 2's experience. Here's what Helldivers 2 can do to avoid similar pitfalls. First, Helldivers 2 should ensure that any in-game purchases are purely cosmetic. This keeps the game fair and focused on player skill rather than how much money someone is willing to spend. A cosmetic-only approach can help maintain player trust and keep the community engaged without feeling exploited. Next, transparency is key. One of the biggest issues with Destiny 2's Eververse was how it was introduced without clear communication. Helldivers 2 can avoid this by being upfront about any monetization strategies and ensuring that players know exactly what they're getting into. This kind of openness can go a long way in maintaining a positive relationship with the player base. Finally, community feedback should be at the heart of any updates or new features. Destiny 2 eventually made changes in response to player outcry, but it was a tough road. Helldivers 2 has the chance to start off on the right foot by actively listening to its players and making adjustments based on their input. In conclusion, Helldivers 2 has the potential to succeed where Destiny 2 stumbled. By focusing on fairness, transparency, and community engagement, it can avoid the controversies that have hurt other games. What do you think? Will Helldivers 2 take these lessons to heart, or could we see history repeat itself? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, happy gaming and stay awesome.